Hello everybody, this is Zaxter99. Today I'm going to share with you guys just something that I found on my computer. Now I work on computers, I build computers all the time. I'm pretty experienced with computers, but I was actually flabbergasted. I was mystified as to why on my hard drive, if I come up here and just double click my computer, or click the computer icon, I was mystified why my computer was just filling up all by itself. Now I do a lot of video editing, I do a lot of, you know, install a lot of games as you can see here. But without even installing any new games and without even making any videos or cleaning up all the videos that I was making, this hard drive just kept filling up like 10 to 20 gigabytes a day it seemed like, just filling up slowly but surely. It was just creeping up to being completely full. And I had no idea where this stuff was going because I was cleaning out all the stuff that I was, you know, all the video data and stuff like that, my recording and stuff like that. I was uh, deleting them and then also re deleting my recycle bin because stuff in your recycle bin will still use up space. But I was cleaning up the recycle bin, and it was still going away. And I'll show you in this video how I actually found out where almost 900 gigabytes of hard drive space had been used and how I cleaned it up real easy. We'll show you that here in this video. Zaxter 99. All right, everybody. Welcome back. I want to go ahead and show you guys where I found out this was going uh, without taking a whole lot of time to do it. Uh, I spent a little bit of time researching it and, and figuring it out, but I want to make this short and simple for you guys. All you need to do is either go to your go to your start right down here on the bottom left on Windows, click that, and come up here to Computer. Or if you have a computer icon, you can just right click it. Either right click either one, and then go down to Properties. Here you're going to come up with your system information uh, and security window. Here you want to go to system protection. Now this is on Windows 7. Other Windows uh, versions of Windows might be a little bit different, but it's all basically the same. You want to go to system protection here. Click that. Here you're going to have another window pop up uh, with your system, pro system protection tab under your system properties. Okay. And you'll see your available hard drives. This is again is my external hard drive. I'm not interested in that. That's not where I was losing data. It was on my main hard drive, my C drive, so be sure you click on that. It'll tell you if your protection is on or off. Now, if it's off, this probably isn't going to apply to you. But if it is on, you can go ahead and click the Configure here button to configure restore points, manage disk space, etc. If you click Configure here, this is where I was blown away. Now, I had never changed this. Last time I reinstalled Windows, I completely wiped everything off my hard drive and reinstalled Windows and all the drivers and everything like that just over a year ago. So it hasn't been that long. But right here on this max usage disk space, this is the maximum disk space used for system protection. And somehow this was up here at, this, this was set at 50%. So 931 gigabytes of my 2 terabyte hard drive was being reserved for system protection disk space, uh, old restore points and stuff like that. I couldn't believe that that much room was being held for all this restore point data and, and that kind of thing. So, first thing I did in current usage right here is where you will actually see how much space is being used for all this garbage that you don't need. Okay, so here is where I had, I think it was 898 uh, gigabytes, 898,000, whatever. It was a huge number here, and it turned out to be it was an 898 gigabytes uh, was being, re had trash in here from old restore points and all this crap that I didn't need. So the first thing I did is I moved this slider all the way down to like 5%. Actually, you probably only needed it like 3% at the most. I checked my other computer, and it's at 1%. So slide this all the way down to 1% to 3%, I would say, at the most. As you can see, I still have 55 gigabytes at 3% because I have a huge hard drive here. So you want to slide that down, first of all, if it is way up here. And then you want to go ahead and delete. This will delete any current usage. Now, when I click delete here, it took my computer at least five minutes to actually go ahead and delete all this stuff. But once I actually hit delete, once you change the setting, you want to make sure you hit apply and OK. OK. And then once I did this, I went back and I checked my hard drive space after it took five minutes on that little window to delete all that crap. Uh, I came here from like 151 gigabytes free to 1.06 terabytes free. So that tells me that over 800 gigabytes, almost 900 gigabytes of uh, space was being used for that crap and I cleaned that up. 
So hopefully this video will help somebody else out, help somebody else clean up their computer and get that setting correct. So let me know in the comments below if this has helped you. Give me a thumbs up, you know, whatever. Let me know if you have the same problem, but something else fixed it, whatever it is. Uh, be sure you subscribe if you want to. This has been Zaxter99. Thanks for watching.